Welcome to the Emperor Snowman. If you're new here, hit the subscribe button and ring that bell. If you're returning, thanks for the support. In tonight's video, we're going to be discussing the Sith, Purebloods. The Sith were a proud and violent species of humanoids who originated on Korriban, a planet within the Horuset system in an isolated outer rim region called the Stygian Caldera. Sith had a larger than average number of individuals with potential to use the force in their species, so high in fact that the entire species was considered strongly force sensitive. The abundant force sensitivity resulted from a symbiotic relationship with the dark side of the force, where they, like the other few creatures that inhabited the planet, derived substance directly from the dark side of the force and empowered it in turn. Adult Sith characteristically had skin of a crimson hue, although infants of the species appeared a lighter shade of red. However, even though typically a dark red, some members of the species retained more pink shades of skin tone in adulthood. Sith had sharp, fierce, predatory profiles and features all over their bodies, including bone spurs protruding from under their skin at various locations like the elbows. Their faces displayed a notable pair of cheek tendrils that hung down from their high cheekbones. Sith also had cranial horns, pointed teeth, and glowing yellow eyes covered by cartilaginous eyebrow stalks. In addition, some Sith had long bony chins, while others did not show this trait and instead possessed less prominent chins that receded from their mouth. Most Sith had three clawed digits on each hand and three on each foot two forward facing and one backwards facing. However, some Sith had five digits on their hands and feet, such as Seknos Wrath. The Sith were commonly left-handed too, and as a result, their signature weapon, Ian Varok, was constructed only for their left-handed tendencies. After their arrival in Sith space after the Hundred Year Darkness, 7000 to 6900 BBY, human dark Jedi began to interbreed with the Sith. For nearly 2,000 years, superstition, loyalty, and sympathy were bred out as the two groups interbred, and qualities such as the cunning, ambition, and affinity to the Force were favored, which shaped Sith society over the centuries. In the Sith Empire, as time progressed, pure-blood Sith were steadily bred out, resulting in only a few pure-blood Sith left in the Sith Empire by the time of the Great Hyperspace War, 5000 BBY. By 44 ABY, the true Sith species in the Empire were believed to have gone extinct due to their interbreeding process. Hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know what you think in the comment section. Thanks for watching. Hit that subscribe button, and we'll see you next time. You have failed me for the last time.